Hi, yeah, in this video we are going to see about the customer's la customized launcher in Android. So whenever I am opening my application, so if I am opening application, uh, I have a custom custom log, log uh, splash screen. So before splash screen, we will we can see some icons is loading like this. After that, our custom log screen will uh, splash screen will come. So uh, this is the uh, previously we will create splash screen by ourselves. So that is not a, a right way right now. We have to give uh, the customized splash screen app screen like that. Uh, once again, let me hold this phone as a window. Now, so uh, the thing is, uh, in Android Studio, we have a uh, we have to implement splash screen will automatically generated by the application when we open the application. So uh, it needs to initialize the process. Okay. So the thing is, you have to this icon and this icon are the major icon for splash screen. So you can, whatever the icon we are giving over here, it should be taken <coughs> as a splash screen icon. So if I, I'll just change this icon to my logo icon. Okay. So this is also to my logo icon. So uh, now when I am, when it is running, uh, it will run as a, my logo icon will run. So, and you can change the background color, <coughs> icon color, and you can add some icon for, uh, other than this, you can add some uh, specific specialized icon, which means uh, other than this, you want to add any animated icons. Like if you open the Gmail, it will open like that, right? So if you want to change all those things, first of all, we need to add one dependency. First, let me show this one this will launch right now just check this one so we have to create uh, we have to add a dependency uh, splash screen core dependency so once it is uh, once we added we can change the default splash screens background color and icon color so now you can see uh, that icon didn't came the icon which i gave that one coming over here okay so this is what the splash screen is so let's see uh, next one okay so once it is done, uh, we can add, uh, I will show you the dependency. So I already added the dependency. So this is the dependency, uh, Android X core, core, splash screen 101, okay, 101. So after this dependency, we can uh, change the depend uh, splash screen things by this style. So over here in the theme style, okay. In the theme style, we can change our uh, splash screen background. So for example, item name this one is android if you see splash screen you can see lot of options right so in this splash screen if you see here splash screen background so this is a color icon so you can change it with color so if i gave black means uh, previously we saw white right if i gave black means it will convert to black so on for your notice it is above 35 above version 31 okay uh when we are writing this one it is we can write this one as a, a api 31 for android so uh next one also same android android window splash screen so uh you can see animated icon so if we have any animated icon or gif uh, like that something so we have to add over here so for now i don't have any animated icon or gif so i didn't add i am not adding over here i'm just adding my old logo and you can add animation duration also so let's for example uh, splash screen if you can't just so splash screen animation duration also so if you uh, want to give animation duration as you can give us what duration you want as animation duration you can give that one right okay so uh, after that you can give lot of so behavior background we already gave animated icon so animated icon we already told right so behavior and brand icon means the icon uh, there is this icon which we can show in the bottom of the splash screen so it will be like any uh, text or any uh, colors of icons it's like brand icon so for here for example i can so brand image uh, Drawable the same I will give something like okay I'll just give this file icon so because I don't have any icon I'm just demonstrating whenever when you are giving you can give your own icon mm -hmm. so I'll change instead of this black I'll 
say some customized color okay uh, customized color like this color okay so this color so when now when i am launching it will run and it will be animated for thousand which means once again and it will go okay so after this also we can do something in our activity which we can load how long we can we need to load the we can load the when when it needs to be uh cancelled when the splash screen removed oh, what we can do and when the splash screen need to remove also we can do so i'll just run this one again and we'll go inside this one so this is my set content view so we can have a set content after set content view we can take splash screen uh, inside the activity okay splash screen okay so we are getting the we are taking the splash screen from the activity so once we took the splash screen wait one second terminating the app it will run let me show you how it is running okay so now if you see this launch screen so the styles which we up updated there right so those those styles will come over here it's like uh, the background color will change the icon will change the bottom brand icon will come okay uh, we'll, we don't want to waste time we'll write over here splash screen so if you see here the icon that background icon this icon okay these are all our splash screen so uh, it is animation duration after all this next it will move to uh, our own splash screen okay splash so this is our uh, my own screen blast splash screen so this will take some few seconds and it will open first but the, basically that splash screen doesn't need so if if i i take the splash screen over here i have some uh, see set on exit animator so you can uh, decide which animation you need when we are exiting uh, existing the application so this is also after r only so we have to, okay recover yes okay after s only so we can based on that we need to filter over here so once it is done we i am going to add some small animated animation over here slide up it will go as a slide up object animator dot of float okay float we can have to show which view means splash screen view we can this take a splash screen view itself over here okay which splash screen view is this it okay this it is a splash screen view this it we need to give okay hmm. dot translate y zero f initial position minus this view dot height dot to float okay so this is a translate slide up animation we need to slide up dot int on Interpolator is equal to anticipate interpolator. Okay, so uh, I'm going to add a duration. Duration is equal to 200 L. Tap to on end. On end. Okay. so when when the splash screen is removing we are going to add over this okay so start start okay so animation is started so you can see the transaction of our application uh, uh, splash screen it will go up okay 
uh, when the splash screen is dismissing so I'll just run this one also then we can have uh, some specific need of like we are loading some data in initial stage after the late data loader we need to remove this splash screen right so for that also uh, Android have something called view tree observable so using that view tree observer we can remove those things okay so for example well I will take this view okay take this view we need to take find view by id so this id should be android so it is coming around android right so we are going to take android id content okay mm, okay so we took the id it's the base root root view actually this one is a root view content dot view tree view tree observer dot add on pre draw listener okay so in this pre draw listener uh, we have uh, it should come like once again Okay. So our application is running. Let's see. Object server dot listener. So for this we have a override function it's open so first we will see the application is launching so you can see you see the transaction it will go up the transaction will be so those are all that's our animation duration so once the for that duration it is taking staying there so you can see i think it is go it slide up okay so once it is done uh, we can add this one so in this method right so this is the method uh, we can choose that uh, pre draw it should be removed or pre draw it should be needed okay so if it is here we need to return one boolean return the boolean if this is true okay else so this is true false okay so this is I am adding like kind of uh, this is a loader uh, which you can say like um, true means so this should be loaded so once it is loaded if it is coming here the splash screen will go okay so you can process any whatever the process uh, you are doing you can do and after that we can if it is finished based on this boolean status we can decide we need to uh, change uh, what is that uh, remove the splash screen and we need to go to the activity screen initialize the activity screen or those things so th those are all you can do it in your main activity screen okay so this is how uh, we can use the customized it is an inbuilt launcher in android application uh, to change the background color icon animation so everything we have see so uh, from here we don't need to create spe special uh, different spe uh, what is that individual screen for uh, our android application individual splash screen for android application i think this is good pretty good for people's okay yeah thank you